Queen Elizabeth's highly anticipated return to the public stage is still on hold for now, following her COVID recovery. Buckingham Palace confirming she will miss today's Commonwealth Day service, a crowning achievement for the monarch. Instead, asking her son, Prince Charles, to stand in. The service is going to be focused on her Platinum Jubilee and looking back to her first um, Commonwealth tour. So it's a really important moment, particularly as we haven't had a Commonwealth Day service for two years. That last service before the pandemic is when Prince Harry and Meghan Markle made their final appearance as senior royals. You could see this sort of uh, friction between the royal couples and the rest of the royal family um, rather than about the Commonwealth. So I think the Queen will be very keen that this year's service is focused on what the Commonwealth is all about, which is unity. And while the palace did not say why the Queen would be absent, officials did say she will continue with other planned engagements, including in-person audiences in the week ahead. The next royal gathering is set for the end of the month, a memorial service for the Queen's late husband, Prince Philip, and drawing some backlash, Prince Harry, who won't be there. He is attending the Invictus Games in April, but his spokesperson said he hopes to visit his grandmother as soon as possible. The 95-year-old royal was diagnosed with COVID last month and experienced mild cold-like symptoms. After canceling some online meetings during her recovery, she was back to work last week, hosting virtual engagements and welcoming Canada's Prime Minister Justin Trudeau to Windsor Castle. While she's showing the world she's on the mend, the Queen's health has been in the spotlight after her hospitalization last October. She even joked about her mobility. Good morning, Your Majesty. How are you? Well, as you can see, I can't move. And this really is a historic year for Britain's longest reigning monarch. Her Platinum Jubilee celebrations are set for June. It's a four-day event marking 70 years of service. I'm going to volunteer to come back to cover that. <laughs> I'll bet. To you. All right, Kathy, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.